Daryl Waltrip is a NASCAR legend. Three championships, over 80 wins. He is definitely a top 10 driver all time. But the 1987 season, it wasn't going so great for him. He was with a new team with Hendrick Motorsports. He had excellent sponsorship and probably one of the best engines and engine builders in racing. But going into the last part of the season, he just wasn't doing well. He hadn't won a race yet. And to add on to all the stress, his wife Stevie Waltrip was pregnant. She'd had three miscarriages previously, including one in 1986. Daryl felt bad for her. And she was not able to go to the track, which was big because she had always been a big um, partner for him emotionally to support him at the racetrack in the heat of NASCAR. On September 17th of 1987, Daryl Waltrip and his wife Stevie had their first child, Jessica Lee Waltrip. But Daryl had to go race at Martinsville, and the race wasn't looking good. He was a lap down with 25 laps to go with the intimidator Dale Earnhardt in the lead. When Earnhardt stopped for fuel, Walter got back on the lead lap, and a caution came out with about 7 laps to go. All of a sudden, things were looking a lot better for DW. He was in third place behind Terry Labonte and Earnhardt himself. Both of the drivers in Labonte and Earnhardt were champions and were very, very tough racers. It was very difficult to pass either one of them, and DW knew he was going to have to do his best. And he did just that. In the last lap, in a spectac spectacular turn of events, he beat Dale Earnhardt in the final turns of turns three and four at Martinsville. Other than being the first, his first win of the season, though, with this new team and a huge confidence builder, he was blessed that morning to find a note from his daughter, or from his wife, that said, win one for me, daddy. It was his first time ever being called a dad, and is definitely one of his top wins, and maybe even his most emotional. You know, I hate what happened over here, but that's what happened to the three cars race on last lap. Uh, that time I was in the right place. Uh, they over in Jerry in the wall going down the back. Jerry tried to get back under him. He got a little sideways, and I bumped him. That was that. You know, you got a rose sitting over there in the toolbox. You think that rose had anything to do with maybe giving you a little bit of Daryl getting some hugs from the crew people that have just worked so hard this year to try to get a win, and he's tremendously emotional right now. Daryl, a rose from you. Daryl, a rose from your daughter over there to wish you good luck today. She sure sent it at the right time. Jessica sent that this morning, and uh, a little note said that uh, how lucky she was to have a dad like me. God really blessed her and to win the race. So I won this for Jessica. Well, the tide ride came home for Rick Hendrick, and I know wherever he's at, he's got to be just about as excited, if not more, than you are. It's a great win. We needed it so badly, and we finally got it. I just real patient all day, and it paid off. Congratulations, Daryl. Thank you.